YouTube, what is up? We are back again. Uh, it's been a little while. I hope everybody is healthy. Um, you and your families. Obviously, what's going on in the world right now. Um, we have another pickup from YesKicks.cn. And uh, first, right off the bat, folks, do not hesitate ordering anything from overseas. You will be fine. As far as any uh, health risks go, you'll be good. I ordered this with no worries whatsoever. Um, uh, you know, they're obviously they're they're dealing with a lot over there. We're dealing with a lot here in the states. Uh, Yeskicks.cn. They came through uh, with another pickup, and I hope everybody there is healthy as well. Um, I'm gonna continue ordering, guys, as long as they're open. Um, I'm not worried. Nevertheless, got another pickup, another Jordan 1 Fearless box. This shoe should be coming out in the next uh, week or so. That's a Jordan 1 box. Size 13 they had in this one, so I went ahead and got size 13. Air Jordan 1, Retro High OG, UNC to Chicago. That's the box they gave me, but that's not the shoe it is. Not a big deal don't care about the box immediately you guys will recognize these are the racer blue Jordan ones with the air zoom and in case you're wondering yes it does have zoom air inside underneath the sole in there you guys ever order a shoe online doesn't matter where it's from that you're not a hundred percent sold on when you guys order it you're like hey it looks good I'm not sure I'm gonna go ahead and pull the trigger Sometimes you get that shoe and you're like, man, I shouldn't have shouldn't have done this one. I should have done something else. Sometimes you get it and you're like, man, I'm glad I did this. This is the case with this shoe right here. I was not 100% sold on this shoe. Things like the clear wings logo up here was like, yeah. And then I was like, patent leather, I'm usually meh. But these are fire. And I'm glad I pulled the trigger on there. First of all, this leather on the side here, it almost feels, it almost doesn't feel like leather. It almost feels like a extremely short-haired suede or almost a new buck. But I guess it's leather, because I mean, but it's extremely soft and malleable, but it, it doesn't feel like a smooth leather. It feel, it's hard to describe. Um... The patent, all the gray parts here are patent leather. Obviously, you can tell by how shiny it is. The wings part up here detaches, so it's not unlike the Off Whites or the Rookie of the Years or something like that. And it's clear, translucent. Obviously, you can see my finger. And then the Jordan on here is just kind of patched on there. I am concerned that because this is not embossed or anything like that, this might rub off eventually. But only time will tell that. And luckily I have a pretty big rotation of shoes, so these won't get worn a whole bunch. The back here, I think this back part is also clear, and then it's just a gray fabric underneath. If that's not true, somebody can correct me. But I, that's what it feels like. Because this right here doesn't quite feel exactly the same as the patent leather over here. This feels more plasticky, like it's like it's translucent like this but underneath it you can kind of see it too if you look real close you can see like the fabric underneath or if you look at this it's just patent leather you can see it quality is super dope came with blue and white laces it's got the zoom tag right there like it should be the bottom of the shoe is like it should be translucent bottom with that gradient red to blue that's the racer blue. For a shoe that's called racer blue, there's not a whole lot of blue on there. This collar on the tongue, I mean, it, it's, bl it's blue under here, but it is well underneath that white. Obviously, the liner is blue, too. But for a shoe that's called racer blue, there's not a terrible amount of blue on it. The tongue says zoom air. Again, translucent. I'm super happy with this pickup, man. I'm 
I wasn't 100% sold on this shoe. I did not like the first Zoom Jordan one they did late last year, that all iridescent one, that 3M, that cracks when you walk. Did not like that one. Did not pull the trigger on that one and do not plan on it. These were a different story. They're a little more toned down as far as the colorway goes. Something much more rockable, in my opinion, than the 3M iridescent. But they're super dope, man. I'm, I'm really glad. Do not hesitate. If you're on the fence about this shoe, I say go for it. If you didn't like it, right, you know, didn't like it at all right off the bat, then you're probably not going to change your mind on this video. But if you're on the fence like I was, I think you'll be happy if you pull the trigger. Patent leather. I normally, I, I not one to go for patent leather Jordan 1s. I don't think I've reviewed any on this channel. Um, not, not big on the patent leather. I don't mind it as much when it's just on the overlays. I don't really go care for it when it's on everything. Overlays, I can deal with it. Everything, I usually don't go for it. But these, man, they're dope. And so I'm, I'm not going to be picking up the Dior's, even reps of them, just because, you know, I don't want people to say, hey, that guy's wearing $2,000 shoes, <laughs> but real or not. But So these are fit that gray aesthetic that I feel that I'm missing in my Jordan 1 clutch. And these fit that pretty wood, pretty good. It's pretty much the gray and white shoe. I'm sorry, I said blue and white laces. Those are actually gray laces. That's a dope shoe though, man. Pick it up. Again, I hope everybody stays healthy. Do not be afraid to order, guys. They are up and running, answering your questions, still getting stuff out in a timely manner. As usual, make sure you check within, make sure your order is in stock before you complete the order. Um, as for everybody at Yes Kicks, I hope all of you are healthy as well. Keep up the good work. I appreciate you. And to everybody who likes these videos, I you know, find them informative, whatever. Hope you and your family stay healthy as well. I'm out. Pick them up, guys. Don't hesitate. If you're on the fence, go for it. It's a nice shoe. Um, should be back up, running pretty regular. You should have a video up every, you know, 10 days or so now. Um, with the new year not gone and, you know, their factory's up and running again, at least for the time being. Um, I'll be getting some more orders in. So stay tuned. Peace. Have a good one, guys. Thanks.